Hey guys, how's it going? Today I'm going to be mocking up some motor mounts using byproduct of this. <laughs> I'll show you guys what I mean. Cardboard. Good old cardboard. So, I need to uh, mock up some body mounts and um, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be using this cardboard box as a template. Just so happens to be uh, a box of that. So, freaking sponsor me already, damn it. Anyways, what I'm going to be doing is mocking it up off the frame and just building one out of cardboard and then I can unfold it, trace that out on some steel, cut it out, and then fold it over and then voila, and or body mount. <coughs> Keep meaning to say engine mount, but it's not an engine mount. So, yeah, I think I might actually have to cut this off first. Just because I need to get my uh, length correct and it's it's offset. So this bolt is actually pretty much right where I need to put the body mount. So I guess I will cut that off first and we'll go from there. But also the body shifted about an inch towards the driver's side. So I need to move it a half inch towards the passenger side so it evens out. Freaking spiders always building their webs. I already had to kill one on the tire. Oh well. Yeah, we'll uh, show you guys how I do this. Alrighty, so with the, the pry bar and my measuring tape, I got the cab all squared up. So I also used my big hammer and drove those boards so that they're not in the way of that uh, body mount there. So now we can go ahead and get those cut off. Um, and those ones too. Yeah, it's a shame those aren't going to work either. There's just nothing's lined up, so oh well. Whew! Once I get those cut off, then uh, I'll show you guys how we're going to make some new ones. guys now that we got the frame all cleaned up and yes I was wearing safety squints <laughs> I like to see so uh, wow, I'm really washed out anyways now that we got the frame all cleaned up uh, we can start mocking up our uh, body mounts using our handy dandy cardboard so I guess the first thing we're gonna do is uh, probably cut this guy in half and then uh, I, I like this side, so we'll we'll uh, trace something out like that, and then uh, we'll use that to see where we sit. Okay, so we got our half box thing here. So now what we'll do is we'll just basically set it up against the frame, and holy crap, that's going to be like full length. Because there's uh, not much give to that, and we're almost all the way to the end of the box. So I'd say... Where'd my pen go? There it is. <laughs> Handy dandy writing device. You know, I'm just going to get rid of this guy for now. Set that against the frame. So center looks... Out there. Uh, 
No. Out there. So I've made a mark for the uh, the center of this bolt here. So that's what we want to aim for for this hole here. Transfer that across. That looks pretty good. This is just a rough, rough mockings up. Um, what I'm going to end up doing probably is uh, when this is all cut to shape and it fits real nice on the frame, I'll uh, unfold it, lay it down on the plate steel, and then I'll trace a circle around and then I'll put a tube there that the uh, body mount can mount up to. So now that we got our mark there, what I'm going to go ahead and do is just start shaping the box and uh, see where see where it ends up. So we'll uh, check back in with you guys in a bit. Well guys, I'm not sure where entirely I left off, but uh, I got the front mount uh, ready to go. Something like that. I'm going to pie cut this end and fold it in on itself on either end and I got the rear one mocked up too. Uh, <laughs> one of my buddies called and I was on the phone with him for a little while while I was working so um, anyways I got the, the two mounts done and uh, I've traced them out onto a piece of steel. Ah, let me go! <laughs> traced them out onto a piece of steel. I got the two rear mounts uh, drawn up and I got one of the front mounts drawn up um, there's not enough steel here to do the other uh, front mount, so I've got to trace that onto another piece of steel. But I've labeled it one, and I've got the, the template marked with the one. So on the next one, I'll flip it over and do the other side, because these sides, one side is different than the other. These ones, they're asymmetrical, so it doesn't matter. But uh, that's a big deal. So anyways, I'll get these cut out, and then uh, we'll see how it looks. I got two of the rear mounts cut out and one of the front mounts cut out. I uh, kind of had a little bit of an incident with the grinder there. It was tracking a little bit weird coming back, but not a huge deal. Those are just bed marks, so I got to fold them where, uh, where it's marked. So on this one I have to flip it upside down, trace another one out of the other piece of steel that I got, and then uh, that'll be the passenger side mount. But this one's the driver's side. So... Um, yeah, I guess I can go ahead and uh, fold them up. I think there's a vise right on the, the bench over there. Oh, that is some slow zoom, I'll tell you what. <laughs> uh, oh, feels like it's starting to rain again. Alright guys, well, I got the uh, engine mount. <laughs> I keep doing that. Body mounts, all cut up and bent. Uh, those two, I kind of, I don't know, kind of messed up. I folded them the opposite way, and they ended up uh, breaking the one side. These ones, I folded them backwards so that the cut was on the outside. I'm going to have to weld those, but uh, they turned out pretty good. So, you'll see they, uh, they're, they're going to work. <laughs> So, I got a little bit more work to do with them. I still got to drill the hole for the uh, the bolt to go through. And then I have to machine something to fit on them. But, with looking at them like this, I'm not going to need much of a body lift. Um, I'm not going to be using that factory master one. So, that looks to be about two and a half, maybe three inches. So, uh, excluding the actual body mount that I get I'm still not sure what I'm gonna what I'm gonna be running but um, might not need that much of a body lift 
maybe uh, an inch and a half or something. So if that's the case, like I can machine my own out of like aluminum or something, but uh, I guess we'll have to see. I'll get uh, these factory pieces of crap uh, removed and then we'll see what uh, what I gotta work with. So anyways, I'm freaking beat. That, uh, that was a lot of work. And uh, I got a big, big day ahead of me tomorrow, so I'm gonna call her a night. I am just all kinds of washed out in this. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, so that'll do it for tonight. I got the uh, body mounts all whipped up, you can tell. Um, I still gotta weld them on, I still got a lot of work to do on them, but that's one more step towards the end goal. Um, it's just little steps at a time and eventually you get there so my goal for end of this month is I don't think it's gonna happen end of uh, was it June January February March April May June yeah I don't think it's gonna happen but uh, I'll just I'll keep trucking along and when it gets done it gets done I'm not worried about it um, it's it's the best way to be just don't don't worry about stuff so anyways That'll do it for tonight, so thanks for watching guys, and until next time, take care.